Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to explain to you how you can disable external sharing for a particular user's OneDrive. Uh, let me explain to you what I'm talking about. So by default, external sharing is enabled on everyone's uh, OneDrive. Uh, so every user, obviously, within your organization, they would have their own OneDrive and they can easily share stuff internally as well as externally. Let's say you want to turn it off. You want to disable it for a specific user. You do not want to disable it uh, for the whole organization, for everyone. You just maybe have one or two users and you would like to disable external sharing for them specifically. Let me explain to you how to do that. So here I am. I'm logged in as Mary. Let's say Mary is one of those users. We need to disable external sharing for Mary uh, for, from her own uh, OneDrive. So obviously, by default, it's on. By default, Mary can uh, uh, invite anyone, essentially anonymous link, generate anonymous link. Um, uh, she can uh, specify sp you know, specific people, I guess, uh, external users. Uh, we need to disable that ability. All right, so uh, let's go to the admin center. Uh, this is where it's controlled. So let me navigate to the admin center. Obviously, you have to be an Office 365 uh, admin to do what I'm about to show you, all right? And uh, just to show you first, by default, obviously, or by default, let me uh, navigate uh, to sharing settings. Uh, they're the same between you know, SharePoint, Admin Center, and OneDrive um, Admin Center. But by default, just to prove the point, uh, the external sharing is enabled. So if you can see over here, by default, I have external sharing enabled uh, in all of my SharePoint sites, uh, as well as uh, OneDrive. All right. Uh, and again, we only need to turn it off for a specific user. So let's go back to the Office 365 Admin Center. Here I am. We need to find the user on the uh, Users tab over here, Active Users. So here is Mary. All right. And then when her profile opens up, we click on OneDrive. All right. And from here, uh, under Sharing, you see we can control the external sharing of Mary's uh, uh, files and folders, essentially her OneDrive. Let's do that. So by default, if you notice again, by default, it's uh, enabled, right? It uh, pretty much goes with the global settings. All right, it inherits the global settings. Uh, and I can be pretty specific. I can say, you know what? Uh, let's only uh, allow authenticated users uh, into Mary's uh, OneDrive. Let's uh, disable, uh, you know, uh, the generation of anonymous link. Uh, links, for example, for Mary, uh, or if I totally want to disable everything, um, you know, the whole external access for Mary, essentially, I will just uncheck the box. You see, by default, it's checked. Uh, let's do that. All right, that's exactly what we're trying to do. So uh, we might as well. So let me do that. Click Save. Here we go. Uh, we applied the settings. Now let's navigate back to Mary's OneDrive. Let's uh, refresh the screen and let's test it out. So Mary is trying to share something. All right. And if you notice, if you notice um, the anyone link, uh, anyone with this link option is grayed out. You see uh, it has been disabled. All right. But even if uh, we try to specify the people here and let me just, uh, you know, type in uh, one of the uh, test email addresses. Here we go. Perfect. Look at this. Mary immediately gets a notice, uh, a note saying that the organization does not allow uh, to share with the uh, with external users. All right, and again, this specific uh, notice will appear for Mary only, uh, not anyone else, because we just disable it on her OneDrive. All right. So that's all I wanted to show you uh, today. Hopefully, you learned something new. As always, happy to see you on my blog, SharePointMaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.